Hello everyone and welcome back to the Dutch Petting Zoo. And as usual, we are joined again by the wonderful Jure. Hello. And uh, yeah, first of all, my apologies. Uh, it has been a while. Uh, I think it was around uh, three or four weeks ago since uh, Jure created a wonderful uh, fried ship. It's and probably sunk been... by now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> no. it's gone. It's not even in the picture anymore. It's uh, yeah, it's it's probably around Spain somewhere. Spain, yeah. like that. Yeah. Um, but in the meantime, I think uh, quite a lot of uh, new people joined the channel, and uh, it might a good uh, might be a good thing to just quickly explain what we are doing. So we started this project uh, a little while ago, and uh, we wanted to create a petting zoo. And it is uh, based in the Netherlands around uh, Slot Louverstein, which is a fortress, uh, probably, uh, I don't know, hundreds of years old. Mm -hmm. And uh, we wanted to do like a recreation, but on the other side, we wanted to make a petting zoo out of it. And uh, that what is what we have been doing so far. So um, yeah, Jure created the castle and uh, I created a uh, street full of uh, peafowls, which is a big mess. And um, <laughs> yeah, so a lot of a lot of things going on. Um, so yeah, if you didn't see the previous episodes yet, make sure you check those out as well on Jure's channel, of course. And um, there will be a, a link down in the uh, description as usual. Yeah. Um, but uh, yeah, what we're doing today, first off, I uh, had no clue what I wanted to add. So I started off with like, uh, yeah, just some fixing uh, of things I created before, like these, uh, uh, the bridge. I fixed that one first, so there was a really ugly path and, and that was it. So um, I used the pieces that you used uh, here on okay. the, um, for the castle. And um, these uh, these walls around the, um, around the fortress. Again, they were a little bit too small, so I wanted to make them a little bit thicker. And nice. in the meantime, I actually uh, visited this place. Uh, I sent you the picture. Oh, did yeah, you, you did. <laughs> no, I forgot yeah. to download it. <laughs> <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> nice, nice. Um, because I want to uh, share the pictures as well with the, with the viewers. Uh, they will be uh, on my Discord channel. I'm sorry, I'm going to promote that, right? <laughs> yeah. uh, so uh, yet again, a link down in the description if you want to uh, see all the reference images. Uh, that I've been using for this build. Um, so yeah, this is a place uh, in the Netherlands. You can still visit it. Um, although the, the virus is still going on, I was able to uh, to go there. And uh, it's actually a really nice and interesting place. Um, the castle itself on the inside is uh, probably the main attraction, which, uh, yeah, we threw some staff buildings in there. But <laughs> <laughs> yeah, anyway, yeah, it, it's a really cool place. So uh, if you ever have uh, yeah some time left and you are in the Netherlands, uh, you should definitely go there. Maybe it's a good idea uh, for me as well. <laughs> yeah, it might be, might be. Um, I was I was expecting quite a lot of inspiration <laughs> when I was going there, but then I went back and I sat down and I, I still had that no clue what I wanted to add. Um, Did you see anything I, peculiar or like interesting there? Um, no, not really. We, we covered most of it. I think um, so. What I'm fixing right now, for example, is just uh, the road towards this place, and there is a uh, another parking lot over here. Mm -hmm. uh, I didn't put much attention in it. I just wanted to make sure that the layout was correct, so we can uh, we can come back to this uh, later on and finish the uh, the entire area. There, yeah, there are some small props that I will be adding uh, today. I tried to recreate like a cannon that I found over there, and uh, okay. Uh, some some other stuff i don't even know the english name for it a schandpaal that's the dutch word oh. and i really have no clue uh, what the word is in english is it like a uh, lock like like where you sit with your arms in these holes yeah, in you your have head to stick your head through and then people can throw tomatoes and oh, yeah, yeah, whatever yeah. you want uh, towards you yeah that's uh, that's a thing uh, i tried to recreate stuff like that it was uh, it was quite fun uh, fun to do and uh Actually, around the entire area, there are some uh, some yeah, cows and, and sheep, and that's what I want to do uh, oh. as well today. Uh, these things are actually there as well. So this is the stuff I created for the pea fowls, so they uh, won't oh. be able to escape. And uh, when you enter this area, you um, you will actually have to drive uh, over them before you can enter this, uh, this stuff. Again, the same uh, blueprints, of course, the Dutch traffic signs, uh, perfect for this build. Um, I you know, I missed one, so I created uh, something. Uh -huh. Yeah, I don't know. It looks right. So, um, but yeah, I, I yet again, it was uh, it was an interesting place. There was also like a, a bomb shelter or something. 
uh, that might be interesting uh, okay. to recreate as well. And then, of course, this tower. And um, yeah, I already explained it to Jure. This is one of the reasons why it took me so long. Because I didn't get the roof um, exactly the way I wanted it. And then I found these uh, roof pieces. And this is actually um, exactly how this roof is shaped. Although I will make it a little bit higher. So the... Um, but the corners and like the I don't know is it like octagonal or something like that. Probably something uh, like that. Yeah, I never yeah, finished yeah, math yeah. in high school, so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe maybe I should have done that. And I, I know how to pronounce that in English. Probably not. But um, so yeah, I'm I'm stealing all your uh, pieces from your from your castle. Mm -hmm. And I actually tried this, yeah, three or four times, and I didn't get it right. It isn't fun, is it? It's just so tedious oh, to do. It's a, it's a horrible job, but. In the end, I'm really happy with uh, with how it's looking, and I'm really happy with the uh, with the result. And I cut out like probably like 45 mi minutes of me <laughs> struggling, trying to get this right. And uh, yeah, once I will start copying this stuff over, uh, you can t see like a sudden jump in time that it's somehow fitting uh, fitting perfectly. It's like year uh, 255 yeah. in a game. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't really see it now, uh, right now, but I, I think it's right. it's probably around that. Um, so the main thing I want to add is this uh, is this little tower. Um, just using the same pieces, same colors as you did. Uh, because yeah, in real life, it's also um, basically the same thing. Yeah, right. And uh, I was happy that I went there because I couldn't really see on like Google Maps how the uh, exact shape of that thing is. Okay. A um, bit like, uh, there's still a little piece of wall going on there, and then there's a uh, entrance, which is, um, yeah, a, a kind of a different shape. Uh, but you can see it fits perfectly now. So you see that? I only have to fix wow. <laughs> some small things. It only took me like 30, uh, 30 seconds in this video, uh, but in real life, it was like hours of, uh, of struggling. I'm sorry. Um, I feel sorry for you. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Yeah, if I could have just used, you know, the shapes that you already made, uh, I can only imagine how much, uh, yeah, work that was. Uh, but yeah, this this roof was just an entirely, a completely different shape. Mm -hmm. So that's uh, why it uh, it took me a little bit longer. So yeah, another part of the recreation of this um, of this tower. Um, some some small walls and and I will add the uh, same doors and windows and stuff like that. But um, I must say it looks cool in the end. Very uh, nice. Very nice. I'm just gonna delete I, it now in the next episode. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think I can do this better. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. No, Especially no. with the with the stuff I add and like later on with the cannon. It was fun just to try to make something that it like completely. Yeah, a random thing basically in a zoo game the yeah. developers probably won't think about adding a cannon or like the what's it called the, the stuff that i added in the previous episode where like instead of the bins um i created these barrels oh yeah it's yeah. it's fun to just <laughs> try something out with the pieces that we have and um, try to make it look like similar to the reference pictures i had i actually uh, sent the uh, people from uh, luverstein an email with uh, with a link to uh, what oh really doing. Yeah, yeah. Did they respond? Yeah, they, yeah, they, they, re they, they responded. It was like, yeah, it looks great, guys. And <laughs> that was it. <laughs> but yeah, so no promotion on their social media or whatsoever. But uh, yeah, I'm I'm actually like pretty proud of, of how this is uh, yeah. coming along. I'm Myth. not sure if you still have some ideas of what uh, you want to add. or uh, Maybe if I see the pictures you made, I forgot to <laughs> look at them all. Oh, I feel so bad. Um, I'm gonna go there myself uh, for sure, though. Uh, I mean, I have nothing better to do, so <laughs> might as well go yeah. there. It's holiday right now, right? So. Yeah. Um, yeah. What can we add now? Like uh, more animals, I guess. A bit more. Maybe uh, another section of the zoo instead of just the main area inside here. Maybe we uh, warp reality a bit and do our own thing a bit more now. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, it's like on the other side, like on the um, like right on. The other side of the water, it would be cool to add like a, a really Dutch farm or something like that. And uh, on the right side, if you look like on the right side, on across the water, there will be um, in real life, there's some cows over there. So we can add the African uh, buffalo, I think. Oh, yeah, that would be, of course. Uh, I a perfect to fit. So I was thinking about like uh, 
some Dutch cow uh, stables or something like that. Oh yeah, and of course we there is like a fortress on the other side of the river. It's yeah, called, there's another uh, one. Fort yeah. Vuren, I think it's called. Yeah, uh, which is a lot newer than this one, and they refurbished it for like Second World War or something, mm -hmm. uh, or before that. Oh, can you hear my dog barking? Oh my god. Yeah, yeah no <laughs> okay. problem. No problem. <laughs> Animal welfare issues <laughs> as usual. <laughs> Uh, but yeah. yeah, we could do that too, and uh, maybe some uh, little speed boats and some little port, maybe. Like just, well, we already have like a, a, a what's it called, a, 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 a pier thing. Yeah. We can yeah, add yeah. maybe some stuff. Yeah, uh, we can add the boat to go to the uh, to the other side. We, we already have the freight ship. Oh, course, yeah. Yeah, so a little pond, is it called, I think. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, so uh, yeah, still a lot of ideas, but <laughs> that's cool. Um, the, the, but yeah, the main thing, probably this area is almost almost finished after this uh, episode. Uh, there's only uh, a, a small bit left that we still have to add. And on the building, there's actually some kind of hotel or better back for bed and breakfast over there. Okay. Uh, the pathing was, uh, again, a struggle. Oh, I'm yeah. not sure if you... Uh, I was kind of uh, friends with the pathing tool in the beginning. But uh, yeah. <laughs> well, welcome to my it, life. Uh, the yeah, <laughs> it, it left me, so yeah. I'm uh, yeah covering everything up. Every every build I did after <laughs> after the first time we had a we had an argument. We, uh, <laughs> That's we the only thing you up. can do, really, just cover it up with something else. Yeah, yeah, it's it's horrible. But yeah, this entire area will be uh, full of uh, sheep, and uh, nah. yeah, ex <laughs> I was waiting for that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Last time I missed your beautiful impression of a. Uh, Oh, was it was a pig? A pig, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I I heard it for the first time while I was editing it, and I was like, "Is that was that Jure? Yes or no?" <laughs> yeah. But yeah, luckily this time I didn't miss it. So uh, I put a lot of them in there uh, again, uh, recreation. So in real life there was a a lot of sheep walking around over there. I uh, created oh, really? some uh, custom uh, fencing. Yeah, really. There okay. was uh, probably like fifty of them <laughs> in uh, in Damn. the same area. Uh, but you can see they uh, keep escaping from like everywhere. So um, that also took me like 30 minutes to uh, fix, but I got the most of that out and the defense actually works because I think the fencing that we have in the game uh, was a little bit too much like uh, big metal fencing for some sheep. Well, in real life, there was like one rope that some shitty barbed wire. Or something. Yeah, 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 ex exactly. There was basically nothing going on, but the the sheep are probably just too lazy to uh, to do something about it <laughs> did you see the you fox on the <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah i thought it was too funny to cut it out so <laughs> yeah um but i have to uh, yeah i made some adjustment to the fencing but it works and it actually looks, uh, it looks quite nice. good and uh, i just wanted to show you as well that we have a lot of uh, issues going on in the zoo some escaping peafowls and escaping sheep and uh so yeah, that's uh, one thing we might have to uh, fix. I had that last and episode I, too. I just didn't yeah, tell you. It was like a yeah, exactly. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I get the zoo, I get like 100 messages of like escaping animals and yeah, stuff like that. And you're just like, yeah, you can fix that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, your name is Zoofluencer, so yeah. yeah I need to build to a freight ship. It's much more important. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, just some simple uh, uh, terrain painting and. Uh, strange stuff going on i had a um, really simple shelter um yeah i really went into like recreating the uh, area in this uh, episode and uh, it's really a shitty uh, shelter if you ask me uh, it's just yeah it's just some wooden logs and there was some food for the animals there and uh, but there were like 50 sheep in there and they uh, this was the only coverage <laughs> they had uh, together with like a really small uh, shelter space on the other side which i will be adding right now wow um, I'm a big fan of these uh, East Asian, um, what are they called? Planks? East Asian planks. Yeah, that's a beautiful uh, name for it. Uh, uh, East, East Asian water wheel planks, something like that. Oh, but they really wheel. fit into, into this area and uh, I'm using them all over the place now. And uh, I must say this is probably not the most beautiful uh, structure uh, you've ever seen me building. But again, it's a recreation. Um, and it might uh, be actually, yeah, if I look at it now. <laughs> I'm kidding. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just looking at what you did before, this is, <laughs> might be the best thing you ever created. Well, thank you very much. Yeah, I was planning to uh, promote you a little bit more. <laughs> 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 that was it. That was it, guys. <laughs> yeah. Um, one thing I wanted to ask you, um, I, I didn't 
as this before. Well, um, I was thinking about doing a uh, live stream uh, at the uh, at the end to do some uh, detailing and uh, and stuff like that. I'm not sure how you feel about that, but yeah, sure. I thought I thought that might be. Uh, might be fun to do it's like a little uh, although, polishing uh thing yeah exactly because i think we yeah probably missed out quite a lot so we can go through the pictures together with the uh, with all the viewers and we uh yeah we can just see what we can polish up and, oh yeah uh, and that will be uh, be it see if we can add another freight ship or yeah, something like that. <laughs> something like that yeah um again some uh, recreation over here this is actually the part that will uh, go up there of course in the planet zoo the guests won't be able to use it uh, no they're not really too clever these guests <laughs> no no we we need something like a uh, null pathing or something that would be cool. yeah that would be cool because then we can do the uh, the tour around all the uh, like the entire stuff i actually walked there and uh, it was raining all day so nice. it was a really fun uh, fun visit uh, so uh, i'm i'm creating a cannon right now and I just uh, showed it to my girlfriend and she laughed at me. So I do hope you, <laughs> <laughs> you guys will like it. It's actually, it like, looks quite similar to the reference picture. I didn't pick these uh, uh, <laughs> like colors and stuff, but it was actually there. So these are the wheels and then you have this wooden structure and uh, some wooden wheels. And it basically it's just a prop so the, the guests can uh, take a picture with this, uh, with this cannon and then, I don't know, make a postcard out of it. <laughs> Welcome to Playmobil World. No kidding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it actually. Uh, I thought it was it was quite creative with like these Ameri or African. Uh, it's a thick cannon. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's quite thick. It's yeah. quite big, but yeah, That's I nice. thought it looked cool. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah. Okay. Luckily, you're not laughing. At me. <laughs> <laughs> I feel a little bit better now. That's good. Yeah, I did. I did the best I can. Um, so just some uh, some finishing touches on this side and i will add uh, another uh, prop over here that which looked even yeah more ridiculous if, if you ask me uh, but again I, I we don't really have the pieces for it in the game and then uh, you start being creative with the stuff you have and i found these rope pieces and it actually looks like you can stick your head through oh, and yeah. uh, put your hands through um but yeah you, you get what i mean right so the, the whole idea is there and uh, yeah that was uh, already it oh Oh, nice! Yeah, I hope you. I hope you liked it. Yeah, I did. I did very much. Okay, that's good. Uh, so the next episode will be on Jure's channel, of course. So make sure you go over there and give him a uh, subscribe. Is that a word? Right yeah, now. Go, go there right now. No. <laughs> go there right, <laughs> right now. Very good. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this one. And uh, if you did, give it a thumbs up. And if you didn't do it already, make sure you subscribe to the channel so you won't miss out on anything new. And I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. Bye.